Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We are here in Kingsbury, Texas, which I'm sure most of you have no idea where that is. We didn't really know where it was before this, but we are at the Pioneer Flight Museum. They got a bunch of World War I stuff here, a bunch of antique cars. I'm really excited. Atlanta could probably care less. Let's go check it out. So most of this stuff is before I, the stuff I'm even interested in. This is all like World War I stuff. It's pretty neat. They got uh, like a tank demo later on. Atlanta still not carrying over here. I don't even know what this stuff is. <laughs> About to go check out an antique garage. You think that's the original like tenters? I have no doubt that is the original Jeep tenting. That's it. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Who are these people? It's like a whole society in here. Who are these people? Do you think they're planning their battle? I think so. I think so. Although it's a mix of like rifles and World War One and like the Wild Wild West. So, see how that turns out. It's like the first semi truck. Made out of wood? Yeah, well, a cab is metal. This is a 1936 Bentley. I didn't even know that they had these in the U.S. That's got to be extremely rare, especially even just being that old. But to have one here in the U.S., wow. Bunch of old cars here. Okay. Yeah, that's all I can classify them as, as old cars. <laughs> you don't know much more than that? Don't know the year. Don't even know what they are. <laughs> They're old. It's incredible the amount of like World War One and older planes they have in this museum. I mean, look at this guy. It's like 1909 or 1910 Curtis. Where do they find this stuff? I wouldn't fly in it. <laughs> Let me tell you that. It's pretty neat though.
can see right here, they uh, they got a bunch of planes that people actually fly in for this thing. <laughs> Does it look like I'm holding it? Yeah, uh, sure. <laughs> uh, a bunch of plane clubs fly in um, to join this thing. It's kind of overcast, the cloud cover is real low. Not as good as turnout this year as they normally do, but they still got a ton of planes out there. A bunch of Piper Cubs, old Stearmans, a little bit of modern planes going on. Man, this place has a ton of stuff for being such a small town event. Hey guys, make sure and check out the Pioneer Flight Museum webpage. It's pioneerflightmuseum.org. On this webpage, you can see their upcoming events, including volunteer days, and also their big event coming up in November. You can also enter to win this Model T touring car. How neat is that? Well guys, that pretty much wraps up this video. Uh, we're just visiting a local event here and uh, I guess this is in Kingsbury. Uh, we stayed at the hotel in Luling, which there's like a big Bucky's there and everything. That's pretty close to this area. But uh, yeah, we were surprised. We had low expectations, but man, they got a lot of stuff here. Um, a lot of people showed up. I guess it's just something we never heard about till now. But um, lots of neat stuff. They're having another one in November. So mark it on your calendars and come out. You might find us dry docking out here so what do you think well, that was cool i mean i'm not a plane and car person but it's really cool to see old stuff from that time period yeah tons of people that were dressed up um to their characters of that time era and all that so um, there's a lot of passion towards this event but all right guys we'll hopefully see you on the next video like subscribe you know what to do bye